we are going to uh, play a man-machine match, which we call Brains versus AI, uh, where we are bringing in four of the top human specialists in Heads Up No Limit Texas Holden to play against the top AI, which is uh, Libratus. Poker has a central role in the history of game theory. The classic challenge problems like Othello, Checkers, Chess, Go, they have all been uh, games where AI has surpassed the best humans. Chess, uh, very famously, Deep Blue beat Garry Kasparov in 1997, and computers have been better than humans in that game ever since. Just last year, AlphaGo famously beat one of the world champions in Go, and this was a major milestone in AI. So there's been a lot of success in these perfect information games. Real world situations uh, deal with hidden information, deal with uncertainty. That's the kind of situation that poker you know, really represents. Limit Texas Hold'em was actually near optimally solved in 2015, while No Limit Texas Hold'em is much harder. And it actually turns out to be the last frontier in a way, at least the last frontier in the foreseeable horizon of game solving in AI. So if you try to take AlphaGo and have it play poker, it wouldn't know how to bluff. It would be very easy to beat. Um, and that's because a game like Go and a game like poker are fundamentally different. When you introduce this element of uncertainty, it changes the dynamic completely. This uncertainty is what we're addressing with Libertus. And it's something that's unique to the algorithms that we're using. We will be playing 20 days. And overall, we will be playing 120,000 hands of poker. There are lots of applications because most real-world situations are games of incomplete information. These include negotiation at the consumer level and business to business, cybersecurity and medical treatment planning, for example. One of the goals of AI is to arrive at something called a general artificial intelligence. This is an AI that can address any situation that it runs into, not just a specific domain like Go or poker. If the field of AI is going to achieve this goal of general artificial intelligence, it needs to be able to address this problem of uncertainty, which comes up a lot in real life. We see these algorithms that are being used in this bot uh, as really advancing the field for those problems. How do, you, how do you deal with uncertainty in the real world?